dominant threat in doubles, and it's pretty safe to say that he was the reason that they won last time. So we'll see what kind of presence he has here today. I honestly feel like SS is just so good in doubles. He's 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 like the the, the Bruce Bros. He's as good as his brother is in singles and doubles. Yes. And SS even in singles is fantastic player. Oh yeah, he is. Both these players, the Bruce Brothers, are phenomenal. Oh my goodness. Wow. Yep. And Arbark knowing that Nessus will like to recover high because of the whole pocket shenanigans goes out there to get him. Yep. Beautiful stuff by Arbark. And Elegant and Arbark are Ooh. beautiful two frames. So now. that two framed him because the hit lag on Arbark's shield prolonged the hitbox from the down smash. So that was actually an excellent placement for that down smash. Yeah, that was an amazing two frame and a beautiful utilization of. Of that shield stun. Oh, but some great conversion coming in from Arvark and Elegant still. Yeah, and Arvark and Elegant are absolutely no stranger to not just these players, but top level play. Because they, these, both of these players, uh, play against K9, and I believe both of them have taken sets off of them, but wow, what an in interesting series of events there. Stock for stock. Yeah. And Villager doing a great job of stock taking right now, three stocks on him. It's still a very, very even game, almost to the percent. Yeah, four stocks each team. This could go either way. The tree is now out of play, so no more axe available to close out that stock. But Villager and Luigi have so much insane kill power. Oh my goodness. Back throw to get body. Back throw to get body and an upbeat. Super hot fire, Super Matt Elegant. Yeah. It's in the building, ladies and gentlemen. If you don't know about SoCal Streams, Elegant is the super hot fire. He will go for that up B kill any chance he gets. But this is still a very even game. Once they close out Elegant stock, it is almost dead even. Oh no. Oh, yep. great walk yep. up down smash. Needs the share stock. And now this is a completely and even an game. And an extra situation. Wow. Bruce. Hold up and off. Are you serious? That was ridiculous. A one stock advantage immediately disintegrated in less than 20 seconds. K9 wow. and uh, wow. the Bruce Brothers Edge Guardian is so phenomenal right now. What a series of events to close out that game. I'm just wow. I'm just wow. That was, that was amazing. That was crazy. That was so good. Beautiful stuff to the Bruce Brothers. Yeah, if you guys are looking to improve your Sheik or Ness, these are the players to watch. These players yes. have so much synergy, uh, and if you're looking to improve your play in doubles, they play with each other so much. They're brothers. They have so much mastery of all of their characters. Sheik, Diddy, Ness, Villager, and they are proficient at landing their moves when they need to, and it's, it's just what beautiful. you gotta do. So beautiful. So, so let's beautiful. see if they can carry that momentum. K9 is an incredibly emotional player, and if he is playing really well, it's pretty much guaranteed he's gonna keep playing well, because he hypes himself up, and he gets himself ready to play the next game. So let's see if they can take that momentum. Oh, this the might be it fish? for Luigi. I think he saw his jump. Yeah, he saw his jump. Okay, but good recovery. Fine. That's one good thing that Sheik has in this matchup against Luigi is Anytime Luigi 4B is off stage, it's a free bouncing fish and a beautiful back wow, air. Wow, that back air killed so early. And the and red team dropped both of their stocks. Now a two stock advantage for blue team. This game is so fast paced. It's all set. There, there, there's no moment's breath between uh, any of the action. <laughs> any? No. Okay, great board smash there. Yeah, and didn't actually. Okay, the good. Spike, but he's gonna yes. make it back. Whoa, 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 whoa! Vanish. Okay, that's what it was. Got it. Got him out of there. I thought it was the uh, forward beat from Villager. I was like, how did nope. that even make any sense? Nope. Okay, vanish. Good, good air dodge. I mean, uh, good edge guard there by K9. Edge guard slash recovery at the same time. We take those. Oh my goodness! So much damage already racked up on K9. 
could lose his stock at any point to, to Villager or Luigi Shenanigan. They both have incredibly early kills. Oh no! And just like that, the just like that, the Shenanigan coming in, and now SS needing to use. Yeah, he had to up B and there. That, that was pocket. really good for Luigi. He closed out uh, Sheik's stock so that when Sheik got the uh, up throw or forward throw up air, it didn't kill him at 140%. Okay, but now he died. Finally, finally losing that first stock. And this is now a, a two stock advantage. This is almost the exact same situation we saw last game. Just one stock more for the for the blue team. So with it, the Bruce Brothers are absolutely not out of this by any means. But if wow. Elegant keeps getting these these great up Bs, they, they are not going to be holding these stocks much longer. They have to be careful here. Yeah, well again, very smart going for that back throw, knowing that Ness was going to try to uh, hit him out of the throw. The back throw has a hitbox on uh, the person he's swinging around. It's a very smart coverage, but back yes. throw. Yes, beautiful back throw. And this might be another one? No. Well, he doesn't want to back throw his partner. His well, he's uh, he, the one. He might have to back throw. Uh, Oh, Elegant is now uh, looking for these up smashes. Just threw out three in a row. And they Ooh. still have a full two stock advantage. Or one stock advantage. Alright, K9 in a good edge guard situation against Villager. And Villager no longer has a jump! And he got the edge guard. This is now an oh, an oh, oh, back throw! This is now a 1v1 between Villager and Ness. This is a very doable matchup Ooh. for SS on stage, but off stage he has to be very, very careful. Oh, a beautiful tree! The tree! Oh, and, and elegant, elegant pop it up! Wow. The one person you can't see on the stream is the one popping up. He is hype! Oh my goodness. He is ready to go! Elegant pops off just hard, just as hard as K9. Arvar giggling like a little boy and Elegant screaming like a warrior. Yeah, what Arvark, a dynamic duo. Arvar. And SS are just the 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 non pop off to kind of sit there like and laugh and they're just looking at their partners like you guys are you guys need to calm down man. You guys no 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 they don't need to calm down. Going crazy. They need to keep the hype going. <laughs> we got a game three situation. The Bruce it, brothers. I love the team dynamics because both of them have like a, a crazy hype person and and a, and a kind of like laid back chill whatever person. Yeah, and Arvik just wiping his nose a little bit. Giggling, looking back at me, <laughs> getting prepared for this next game, and Elegant is death staring the TV, looking like the TV just killed his first unborn child. Oh. They're um, ready to go. That's, I mean, that's an image that we probably just... Let's move on. Move on. Moving on to the next game. Game three. Get hype. Yeah, and it's every time, every time K9 versus, or every time K9 Sheik versus some Luigi, we saw with we saw with Con Con and now we're saying it with Elegant. It's a pop off war. Dude, who's, it is a pop off war. Who's gonna have the better pop off? Whoever pops off hardest is is the winner, clearly. So we're gonna get this game three on to final destination. Let's see where this goes. That Luigi Nair just got him out of two combo yeah, strings. <laughs> he just Nair, Jeff. Yeah, it's a beautiful uh, way to cancel out string. The boots of frame two or frame frame three Nair. Three, yes. Smash A, dude. Just smash the A button. Just and click A. Oh! And SS switching to Villager. Now we got Villager dittos. Yeah, and last time we saw uh, S Bruce, or S sorry, SS switch characters, he they won the set very convincingly. Handily. But that last time they played, he switched on to Ness. So now we're switching on to Villager. Let's see if this new character is going to provide some new insight or new possibilities for this matchup here. Here's the thing. Arbark is just too good at at uh, getting the pocket. Yes. He Very follows true. him so well, so it, it was just it was just too hard. But right now, Blue Team has all the stage and, uh, stage control in the world right now. Double edge guard situation, but SS recovering back with that down air. And oh, a beautiful wow. spike! But Wait, no, he spiked the wrong yeah. one! No, well, he took his partner off the side as well. Oh, I couldn't tell who got spiked. Yeah, somebody SS got spiked, got somebody got killed. Either yeah. way. Arvark spiked SS, but he hit him with a uh, hit elegant with a side hitbox off the side. So that wow. was unfortunate. But, you know. Arvark taking all the names. Saying, I don't care who's in my way. 
I'm gonna take you down. They call him Pillager for a reason, dude. Very true. Once again, fighting for that stage control. Oh, he went for the dare. Oh. oh. Okay. Well. Get Elegant just edge guarded. Yeah, he he edge guarded his own partner, but it, I mean, they, they, they both made it back. So. They did. I mean, Villager recovery, it, it's very hard for Villager to be hit by Cyclone unless they are very low on the stage. Uh, or unless they have wa they've wasted or enough of their balloon. Yeah, it's very true. Yeah. A bouncy fit. That's exactly what I was saying earlier. If Luigi four bees to stage, oh my God, Arvark! And this is almost dead even. They just closed out both of those stocks. Arvark still has three stocks. Combinator's curse. Please don't, don't strike me dead here. But what a beautiful series of events for Blue Team taking the advantage here in game three. Oh my goodness! All the pellets and needles and yeah, Arvark. Getting that down throw string onto SS. Trying to rack up the damage, get as much extra credit he can before he drops this deck and it's uh, stuck and it's back to an even stock count. Oh, the pivot grab, not gonna be enough at 107. No, and Elegant was allowed to recover for free. Nobody went off stage to contest him. That up tilt, so strong. The next up tilt will kill. Oh yeah, definitely. That was actually scary. Elegant got a misfire, he would have just killed his partner. Okay, Elegant. Don't know what he's looking for, but he's out of jumps. He's gonna have to mash really hard. Is but he? Oh, yeah. wow, yeah, he, he was. And this is now in Red Team's favor. All they have to do is close out Villager's stock, and it is in Red Team's advantage. Finally, there it is! Finally taking that stock off of our bar. Yeah, the Bruce brothers, the, the Bruce brothers now take their advantage. Oh. Oh, Good great tech. tech. Okay. Blue team back in. Oh, it. my goodness. Hold that ball. Again, no. Oh. Elegant just missing the ledge, barely losing that stock. Arvark not entirely out of this. Still possible. But very unfortunate SD at a very low percent. Oh, wow. Okay, getting the pellet pocket instead of the white pocket. And they both, they both pocket there. This is actually ridiculous. I'm so not, many Lloyd rockets on screen right now. I'm not sure what's going on anymore. This is getting kind of out of hand. Yeah, Arvark trying to close out this stock. Honestly, this is still very doable for Arvark. Yeah, if he closes out Villager's stock, I'm assuming there's gonna be a stock share, and it's just him versus K9. Yeah. Or it might be him versus uh, SS. Yeah, he could close out K9's stock just as easily. To be honest, he's called Killager for a reason. But K9's beautiful edge guard right now might just be the end of this set. Oh, no, it's not. Wow. Arvark makes it back. That was. Oh, there it my is. Goodness. Grab release into the bowling ball. Beautiful stuff by the Bruce brothers. Unfortunate SD elegant. Not looking too happy about that. But gonna have to make a loser's run. Man. Wow. So much emotion in that.